Next, we have Micah with the physics of skateboarding, taking a specific look at Newton's laws of motion. Newton's first law states that an object at rest tends to stay at rest unless acted upon by a net force. Here we see Micah at rest. An object at rest stays at rest. Newton's first law also states that an object in motion wants to stay in motion in a straight line and at a constant speed unless it's acted upon by a net force. Here Micah demonstrates this effect by moving at a constant speed in a straight line without applying any external forces. Newton's second law states that the acceleration of an object is directly proportional to the force applied and inversely proportional to its mass. More simply put, force is equal to mass times acceleration. Micah demonstrates this on the skateboard by applying a small force and receiving a small acceleration. Looking a little more closely at Newton's second law, F equals ma, we see that for a given force, if we have a small mass, we receive a large acceleration. Here, Micah accelerates the skateboard with the same force, but with the low mass, we see a higher acceleration. Newton's second law also covers the concept of braking. If we apply a force in the direction opposite the object's motion, for example, by dragging an end of the skateboard on the ground using friction, you obtain an acceleration in the direction opposite the object's motion, therefore the object slows down until it comes to rest. Here we see Micah using friction to slow down his skateboard and give himself a negative acceleration. Newton's third law states that whenever a first body exerts a force F on a second body, the second body exerts a force minus F back on the first body, and that force is equal in magnitude and opposite in direction to the original force. This can also be written mathematically as the force of object 1 on 2 is equal and opposite to the force of 2 on 1. This is more commonly known as the law of action-reaction. For every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. <laughs> Finally, we can look at Newton's laws in terms of conservation of momentum. The law of conservation of momentum states that the total momentum in any closed system is always the same unless an outside force acts upon it. Let's end with a bit of a challenge. How do you explain this trick Micah performs on his skateboard in terms of Newton's laws of motion? Pretty cool, huh?